Yo, what's good, man? It's your boy JR Swag Life TV. Uh, Lady Swag TV. You feel me? And tonight, man, I know tonight is Taco Tuesday, but like I said, like I've always told you, we're going to always go against the grain. We're going to always go against the norm, and we're going to always bring you that A1, that triple A, not the car service type meal. And tonight is no different. Um, tonight, man, I'm bringing you something that I know most definitely I've never seen done. And <laughs> it was prepared by the hands of no one else but Lady Swag TV herself. <laughs> Shout out to wifey. As always, for lacing the plate. You know what I mean? She stay having me eat good. We stay eating good on this side. Like I told you, man, the holidays coming up. Yo, if you want recipes, even if you want the meal itself, shout out the kid, man. Holla at me. Hit me uh, in my email, jrunderwood718 at gmail.com for uh, catering prices, meals, menus, all of that. You feel me? But, man, before we get into all of that, man, this ain't going to be too much of a long video. You know what I mean? Because I'm hungry. I'm famished. So, uh, but I do have a story for y'all tonight, though. You feel me? Um, if you're new to the channel, welcome. JR, Swag Life TV, the host with the most. Drip King, Sauce Boss. You know what it is. Um, yeah, man, like I said, tonight we're doing something different. Always going against the grain. We're going to do, do it like this, man. I'm just going to show you the meal. Check that. That's that steelhead trout with the mango and gray poupon coated crust <laughs> with the shrimp in the yellow rice and broccoli, man. Like I said, we're going to always do something different. We're going to always bring you something exclusive. You feel me? But uh, yeah, man, if you're part of the fam already, you know what it is. You feel me? If you're new, hit that subscribe button. That like button, smash smash that like button, get this video a thumbs up. Drop down in the comments, let me know what you thought, let me know what you think, let me know what you're thinking. You feel me? Uh, and last but not least, man, go ahead, make sure, most definitely, you hit that post notification bell so you'll never miss an upload, you'll always be notified. But without further ado, man, we're going to go ahead and bless the hands, most definitely. Bless the food, and we're going to get into it, man. All right? All right, so what's popping with y'all tonight, man? What's good on this Tuesday? Um, this video is being made uh, in correlation with Lady Swag TV, Swag Splash, Swag Fit TV, Swag Life TV. You know what I'm saying? Same swag station, same swag channel. You know what it is, man. But yeah, man, y'all go ahead and get that first bite of that, of that broccoli B. You know what I mean? Got to get your greenery. But yeah, man, this video is being made and coming to you somewhat with a, uh, look at that, man, that steelhead trout right there, B. You know what I mean? We're going to bring, we're going to try to bring y'all every fish under the water. You feel me? And he going to be eating them because I don't do too many fishes. <laughs> what can I say, man? <laughs> you feel me? But yeah, um. I don't know if you've been keeping up with it, but um, prayers go to um, Lil Camille Cupcake, Cupcake McKinney. Uh, her body was found two days ago. No, it was found today. Wasn't oh. It? Was it found today? Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. My bad, y'all. From the report... From the coroner's report, it was saying that she had been dead approximately forty-eight hours. Uh, if you're unfamiliar yes, with the, if you're unfamiliar with the story, um, little girl was kidnapped from a Avondale housing community, which is a uh, which is a housing community in the city of Birmingham, Alabama, uh, and. When the story first broke, the details of the story 
were somewhat sketchy. But like I said, and like I told y'all, y'all already know. The kid is logic. You feel me? I'm all about logic. That's just super sad. Like, I'm, mm -mm. You know, details first came out saying that the father owed his drug plug There's money. There's all kind of mess coming out other than the truth. And like wife you said, so many different versions of the story was coming out that it's really hard to believe or what you think you may know about the story. But it's a very sad situation. I myself, I wasn't privy to all of the information. Um, because for one, we don't live in the city of Birmingham. But, yo. <laughs> this that steelhead trout, man. You know what I mean? High in protein. High in good fatty acids. You dig? But yeah, man. Um, Like I said, I wasn't too privy to all of the information. And, um... But from what I do know, Lil Cupcake was at a party. Um, there was adult supervision there, but it wasn't the adult supervision of her parents, if I'm not mistaken. It wasn't. Um, so, it's a lot of extenuating factors that go along with this story because... The person whose party little cupcake was at. Once the party was over, all of your children's guests and your guests have left, and this child is still there, unsupervised by a parental source. But on the video they released, she was just out there with another little child at that time. But of course. The girl who was throwing the party also said that the party was over at, at that time, that they were gone. And you could clearly see it was no party going on where these two little kids were playing on this playground or wherever they were playing at. Okay, now y'all heard that. So, like someone did a live video yesterday on Facebook talking about the situation. Talking about this exact situation that we're talking about. How little Camille was left at the party unattended. After the party was over, her and another child were at the playground still. You know what I'm saying? And see, even though daylight saving time hasn't kicked in for us, hell, 545, 6 o'clock is damn near dark. It was later than that, though. You know what I'm saying? So if it's later than that, that means night has fallen. It ain't dust. Mm -hmm. It ain't no. none of that. Night has fallen. Yeah. So, if night has fallen and you know that your party has been over for at least a good 30, 20, 30 minutes, 40 minutes. And you still see these two children outside unattended. They didn't see them outside or they left. Well, <laughs> anybody. They left. They actually left. And I couldn't um, I couldn't believe the girl came on Facebook and said that, like, I can't believe you are a mother yourself. You leave this child outside. Like, what? Okay, you feed this child. You give the child ice cream and cake and everything. But you leave this child outside? I 
mean, you know, me being a mom, I would have took the kid inside until somebody came to look for her. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? And if they, eventually, somebody was going to come looking for whoever she belonged to. Exactly. And for those of you out there with young children, because we have young children, you know what I'm saying? Our two youngest is 11 and 5. So you already know. Swag Life fam, you already know. Lady Swag TV fam, Swag Splash, Swag <laughs> Fit fam, you already know. That ain't going down on JR's watch. Mm -mm, mm -mm. You already know that. You already know that my kid. I'll tell you like this. If I be apprehensive, and a lot of you may be like, yo, what's the deal with that? But if I be apprehensive to let my own children go over my mother's house, let alone spend the night. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you already know my kids is not finna be at no party unattended, me and Lady Swag not there, none of that. You already know that's not going down on JR's watch. You already know that. And I'm pretty sure it wouldn't go down on your watch. But let alone, even if it was our party that we were throwing, and I see, or Lady Swag see, two kids at our party, unsupervised, those were two very small children. Those I'm talking about, and little cupcake ain't number three. That's just sad. So this baby's life has been cut short before it even starts, all because of the neglect, the ir the irresponsibility of several adults. Of several adults. Several. So. But like I said, I first and foremost want to apologize for not having all the facts of the story before I brought it to you if you don't know about it. But you can also Google it. Camille Cupcake McKinney. Oh, that was um, worldwide. Like, yeah. yeah so. You know what I'm saying? It made world news. It made it Nancy did. Grace. Mm -hmm. So you know if it made Nancy Grace, it was serious. But yeah, man, this Saturday night, um, wifey and I will be having another uh, smoke and sip. Sip and talk. Sip and talk, smoke and sip, Whatever lady swag, uh, on Swag Splash Swag Fit TV. Uh, I'll be doing the Thanksgiving on the video Sunday too. And also, make sure you tune in. Same. The Lady Swag TV's channel Sunday. Uh, she's going to be doing an easy how to recipe for, if I'm not mistaken, dressing, right, baby? Mm -hmm. Dressing for the holidays. Dressing easy to make anyway. I mean, of course, it's easy to make, but you know. I'm not going to speak on that because for me, that's neither here nor there. <laughs> you know? But. Oh, yeah, man. Look at that. Look at that joint right there, man. Look at that. Look at that mandarin orange on top. Ain't good on this side, baby. Triple A. Not the car yeah. service. <laughs> you um, probably scared them kids. She ain't crispy. You need that thing. But yeah, you know, um, like I said, another sip and talk Saturday, maybe about nine o'clock or so. You know what I mean? Make sure you tune in. Like I said, same swag station, same swag channel, same drip, same sauce, you know. Came across this, it's damn near gone, y'all, but came across this <laughs> Sprite right here. It's At the gas station. Good, yeah. I don't know if you can see the name. Winter Spiced Cranberry. I like that better than I like regular Sprite. Cause Sprite and it's has, pretty good. It is. You know what I mean? But yeah, man. 
You're going to be able to eat that tomorrow. What, this? Yeah. I'm talking about the food taking it for lunch? You, I got some you now. Oh, okay, yeah. I don't know if I want to take it for lunch, but you know what I'm saying? I eat it when I come home. Oh, okay. But, yeah, man. But, yeah, all throughout the holidays, Lady Swag will be, will be uploading videos mm -hmm. and giving you guys inside tips different recipes how to's very simple very easy you know what i'm saying it would it will cut down your holiday cooking time it will in half so like i said make sure you tune in lady swag this sunday will be thanksgiving dressing um we're gonna do the vlog let you guys see what all we pick up from the store and uh it's gonna also be the recipe and the Coming together of everything, mm -hmm. if you will. But yeah, man. Yeah. Like I said, it wasn't going to be a long video. Just wanted to bring you guys this meal. Talk to the fam for a minute. I mean, like I said, if you're new to the channel... Welcome to JR Swag Life TV, Swag Splash Swag Fit TV, Lady Swag TV. You know what I mean? All in correlation. This is a Swag Life TV production, Lady Swag TV production. You know what it is. Uh, like I said, man, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You feel me? Make sure you hit that uh, like button. Smash that like button for me. Get this video a thumbs up. Uh, the notification bell so you will always get notified exactly you heard wifey man hit that notification bell so you always get notified and uh drop down in the comments man let me know what you thought let me know what you think let me know what you think you feel me oh uh, but yeah man we finna get up out of here could have been anywhere in the world but tonight you're kicking it with your boy appreciate it we gladly appreciate it you know what i mean same love and respect shown admiration you already know it's gonna be reciprocated hundredfold you did but yeah man we finna get up out of here appreciate you tuning in same swag station same swag channel it's your boy jr swag like tv the host with the most the drip king the sauce boss yeah, and uh we finna get up out of here man but remember always remember if you're gonna do it do it big Go big or go home. And remember, love, live, life, man. It's your boy, JR Swag, like TV. Peace.